welcome to my channel have a nice day to everyone in this video I'm going to show you on how to install the fuel injection pump as well as the exact gear timings injector pressure test and the last is engine running test this is Perkins 1103A turbo diesel engine so let's get started So first thing to do is to set the cylinder number one in the top dead center and I'm going to show you the timing. So right here in front of the shot there is a mark and it should be aligned with the pump's name Delphi. So this is very practical timing and the most accurate timing is right here. You can see a tiny hole. So I'm using a tiny wire to poke the tiny hole and try to reach the bottom part of the hole. So this is the accurate timing. Right here. This pipe is to be connected to the fuel line number one. Right here. So I'm going to install it. And by the way, don't forget the O-ring just to avoid some oil leakages. So these are the accurate timings. So right here at the camshaft timing gear, there is a timing hole also or if you just put a bolt, so it is a timing lock. And the timing marks are both aligned. And this is the injection pump timing gear. It should be aligned also to the idler timing gear. So right now, both timing marks are securely or properly aligned. So we can now tighten the lock nut of the injection pump timing gear. So these are the three injectors. And before I'm going to install this, so I have to make sure that the fuel pressure is accurate or optimized. So these three injectors were came from the calibration center. They calibrated and changed the three pieces of spray tips or nozzle tips. So I'm going to observe the fuel pressure if it is optimized and to make sure that 
there will be no drops of diesel right after the spray. So it looks good. Just like that. Again. So try to check the nozzle tip again. So it looks good. And there are no drops of diesel. So this injector is working good or in good condition. So I already installed these three injectors and also the fuel lines also connected to the fuel injection pump. So this is my basic electrical connections for a manual starting test. Positive and starter solenoid for starting and fuel pump connections and solenoid connections positive and negative ready to start So thank God it really works and it's already started. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you learned something about the fuel pump installation and the timings, injector test. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and see you on my next video. Thank you.